Hey guys, what's going on? The Brickboy103 here again today, and I am doing a versus speed run on Sonic Forces with uh, Denova. So yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, good. If, I'm sorry if my uh, intro is kind of rushed here. I'm getting right into this. I'm not gonna let him win. <laughs> I don't I'm know super about that. nervous right now. Even though this game is kind of autopilot in a sense. Oh, I I All almost right, missed you. the boost. You know okay. the item that I have to pick up to yeah. get the boost? Oh <laughs> my gosh, I'm so nervous. <laughs> Man, look at the size of that thing. I still kind of messed up right there. I didn't mess up badly, but I, I kind of missed my jump for a split second, so I'm, I'm nervous. I hope I, that doesn't screw me over. All right. All right, I'm screwing up a nail bet. Looking decent. Can't forget the shortcut. Muy bueno. Let's go. What? I think we're about at the same part right now. Done. A minute and eight. Let's go. A minute and nine. <laughs> that was really close. All right, go, go, go. Freaking skip the stupid cutscenes. Alright. Cool, cool, cool. Why is there so many cutscenes? <laughs> That's what I'm saying. This is a Sonic right. game. We're not here for cutscenes. Wait, why? I thought I found and here's a shortcut. Where you're what? Oh my. Looks wow. great. No! I just spammed through that. <laughs> I clicked start over. What did you do? I accidentally click start over. Complete. Looks great. <laughs> oh my god. If that ruins the speed run for me. I'm willing I to bet that freaking... I'm going to screw up at some part. Stupid. So currently team. I'm in the lead. Alright. Okay, I don't care about Team Sonic and Team Eggman. Just get me to the next stage. You can now play as all the boys. Can you all hear right. me button stage mashing two. right now? I'm in stage two right now. All right. Boom. I'm in stage two. That took forever. I don't know how much concentration this is going to take from both of us because we both need to do like decent commentary for this. I know. I feel like my commentary is already awful because I'm <laughs> so focused on this. I'm so nervous. Guys, if you enjoyed this video, slap a like. I just realized something we both forgot to do. What? That we're going to have to do on the next episode. We what? forgot to set a timer for this. Oh, well. <laughs> oh, my God. All right. Oh, my God. Let's go. Let's go. <sighs> this music is pumping me up right now. I made the stupidest mistake. What'd you do? I forgot what button it is to use the special thing of the <laughs> avatar. So I... <laughs> you're probably ahead by like 10 seconds right now. Good. Let's hope I don't mess up right here. I'm not good at the avatar stages though. Alright, cool. Got that burst. Get on that train. Stay on that train. My custom character wait, looks wait. so gay right now, but I just rushed <laughs> through it. Alright, boom. So, uh, what do you think about people getting upset that the main character in Battlefield 5 is, uh, female? Uh, I don't know how to feel about that. <laughs> I think I don't it's feel the like, stupidest thing ever. <laughs> I don't feel like it really matters. Exactly. To be honest, They're I don't really think... Like, they're saying like it's an SJW push game or something like that. It's stupid. No! I mean... Oh, I almost died. I mean, I understand why people would maybe think that, but I don't really think that's the case. Here's the thing. People are saying it's for the campaign. It's not. You can customize your own character for multiplayer. Like, come on. <laughs> that's kind of ridiculous. Exactly. All right, come on. Are you at the I end of stage two yet? No. I'm almost to the end. I'm getting close. 
Oh my gosh. Go, go, go. Go and done. Two minutes, 19 seconds. I, I, I see the end right there. All right. So I'm slightly done. ahead. Yeah, just I'm because just I bought in mashing right now, dude. <laughs> the only reason uh, you're ahead is because I completely forgot how to use the special ability of the avatar. Well, thank goodness, because I messed up customizing my avatar. All right, I don't care about Persona Five. I really don't. <laughs> Skips is how many cutscenes are there? Seriously. Sonic T-shirts. Oh, Don't modern you wanna... Sonic. I am so bad at this. Classic Sonic is not good in this game. The controls Whatsoever. are awful. Like, just compared to Mania, he's the controls are nowhere near where exactly. it needs to be. That's what game. messes me up. The controls on uh, Classic Sonic. The controls in general, honestly, are so bad in Forces. They just yeah. feel clunky. Even, I was playing Generations the uh, the past couple of nights, and trying to go from Generations to this is such a downgrade. Because in Generations, you were able to drift with modern Sonic, and you can't do that in Forces at all. Yeah, I was watching some uh, mod videos, Kobaner Man at 456, I was watching some of his Generation mod videos, and it looks so much better than uh, Forces. Oh, it, it most definitely is a better game than Forces. Forces is extremely mediocre when it comes down to... Well, at least comparing it to the other Minor I only Sonic play, games. I only played a bit of Generations, and it was on Xbox, so I didn't get to experience the mods. But from what I played, it was fun. Even just playing the game without mods, it's still a great game. Uh, I'd rather play it with mods, though. Yeah, with mods, it makes it a lot more fun. I'm messing up uh -oh. so badly on this right now, you're definitely getting the lead. I don't know, I'm going kind of slow, but... I don't know, I no, might take the I, lead here. I keep hitting enemies, so... All right, oh end my stage. god. You finished? I beat that stage with 1 minute and 12 seconds. Oh my god. I'm on a minute 42. <laughs> and I'm still not done. Oh yeah, also, I'm going to give you a free tip. Um, free if you collect the red rings, uh, you have to go through more cutscenes. For getting right. more stuff for well, your avatar. I only get like one per stage, so. If you're able to avoid them, if you know where they are, try avoiding them. Well, I mean, it's just an accident because I'll be mid-air and I just run into one. Yeah. There's right, one skip. in the first stage that I was able to skip that I knew of. There has to be a faster way to get through these cutscenes. I know. The it's stupid. Alright, on to stage four. I, th I swear I turned off the radio thing, and it's on. Oh, my <laughs> God. Stage four. Go. Up, All right. Prison Hall. Enemies. I'm good at this one, so I should be able to come back a bit. I'm decent at this stage. All right. Go. I think the boss fights are really going to determine who wins this. Oh, yeah, definitely. As you remember from when I tried speedrunning this game, it really was the bosses that killed me. Yeah. And then also that one stage at the very end of the game. Yeah, <laughs> that one Sonic. stage. That too, the first time I played through it, it took me like 16 to 20 minutes. I wish I had time to practice this before we did this. Because that I needed to practice that final stage. If it makes I'm willing you feel, to bet that I am going to screw up on that at the end, but you might as it, well. If so it makes that's you feel, on. if it makes you feel any better, honestly, I uh, only practice. I mainly practice stage one. Oh really? Yeah. Why did you only practice want, that stage? Well, because I was not too good at it. So I mean, I wanted <laughs> to get an advantage early on, and then also I felt confident about these, so. I feel like either way, this versus is going to end really cl close. Yeah. I'm willing to bet that one of us is only going to win by like a minute. I was thinking, uh, you were saying like, you know, how story games won't really work for speedrunning and stuff. But I was thinking like, 
if we wanted to do a mini episode of versus, we could maybe do like if we were doing Batman, they do have like AR challenges and we could find a really hard one on there and see who gets like the best score or best time or whatever. There's a way that we could right, integrate that into a format like this. Yeah. There's other versions of this called like Moose or something that you're able to do like everyone like the two people who are doing it do choose missions out and if you lose the mission you get a letter. So it's kind of like that the actual basketball game called Moose or Horse or whatever it's called. All right. And whoever gets their letters filled up the most loses. I'm on stage 5. I oh, this finished boss stage fight. 4 already as well. This boss fight i swear this is a boss fight that i either do super good on or i screw up and it costs me like five minutes <laughs> all right. because once on i screw five. up i just can't stop messing up on this all right what's i have to remember how to beat him yeah i was gonna say how do you beat this guy <laughs> that's gonna be the biggest challenge of uh, this oh no you can remember how to beat him Oh my god. He knocked me down to zero rings. Oh Jesus. Guys, if you're enjoying this, slap the like button. Subscribe. Right. Subscribe to Denova. Alright, I got him. I got him. I figured it out. Okay. So how often are we gonna be uploading these? What? How often are we gonna be doing these? Well, I think we're going to be able to finish this tonight. No, I just mean, like, how so, often are we going to be uploading uh, episodes for the series? Like, if we're speedrunning another game, like, how often are we going to be uploading games? I feel like we could do it, like, maybe once or twice a week. All right. So, yeah, look out at least once a week for some... Oh, I screwed up on that. Look up... Look out at least once a week for a new game that we'll be doing a versus on. What did you want to do next after this game? I don't know. <laughs> Actually, that's a stupid question. I already know the answer. What? Have you finished oh, no. the boss fight yet? No. Have you? Um, I'm about halfway through it. Yeah, I'm about a fourth of the way. All right, now I'm about halfway. Oh shoot, I made a mistake. Mistakes for me. Hopefully that doesn't cost me this. I feel like I'm screwing up my commentary so badly right now because I'm so <laughs> focused on this. But all that all right, then matters we pick is up winning, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> Who cares about the commentary? I just want to <laughs> win. Alright, let's pick up on the commentary then. Let's talk about right. E3, since that's coming up in the next couple weeks. Dude, E3 is going to be so awesome. I don't know what I'm most excited for, to be honest, at this point. A lot of stuff from Sony, they aren't showing too much, as far as I'm aware. But the stuff they are showing is some really good stuff. I'm super interested in the Death Stranding gameplay. Yeah, Death Stranding. I have a yeah. friend who's super excited for that. that he's kind of like where I am with Smash, where he doesn't really care about anything else. Oh my god, I keep screwing up on this. I already beat it. <laughs> <laughs> I messed up twice on his attack. Like, it gets to the point where I'm able to attack him, but for some reason Sonic doesn't want to target onto him. Oh yeah, you gotta time it just right if you want to be able to target him. That's the main problem with the boss fight. If you don't time it right, you're screwed. Oh, that's the end right there. All right, I'm going on to stage six. Um, but also, I know you don't care too much about Halo, but uh, I'm a huge Halo fan, and I would love to see Halo Six at E3. Even though it's probably not coming out till next year, I would love to see a trailer for it. I just want to see anything from Microsoft, to be honest. Exactly, Microsoft. If they don't come out with something, they're screwed. Like. What if, what if they had this year? State of the K2? Meh. Alright. Like, I mean... And what? Sea of Thieves? Another very meh game. Like, they're in trouble. And then also alongside that, they're not even having a booth at E3. Yeah, that... They're just that doing their presentation. a lot of red flags in my opinion. Like, 
the fact that you don't right now i'm mostly concerned that they're not going to show anything at e3 and this might be the last e3 for like an xbox brand because i think what they're going to do moving on in the future is that they're just gonna damn it (laughs) I get a feeling like they're just not going to have Xbox anymore. I feel like they're going to mainly move on to PC soon. I don't know. That seems we'll just have to, to be to what see. they Yeah, it just seems like that they're just moving so much to being PC only. I think they just want to combine the brands, honestly. But you could be right. Yeah. It's just odd that they don't have anything at all. Because even if we're just talking about them just being a PC platform... They still don't have anything. Exactly. I think they're just screwed. I just think they're not getting new stuff out fast enough. Yeah. I mean, I've already stated multiple times before. I would buy an Xbox if they put Banjo Kazooie or Conquer on it. Dude, people are saying there's some people saying that there's gonna be some rare IPs at E3. So I hope so. Well, that's. That both makes me excited, but also terrified, because yeah, the because last time they CFDs. used a rare, well, the last time they used a rare IP was um, when Young Conquer came out, or at least when I'm talking about like classic, yeah, rare plot, rare games. So I'm I, not even sure if the team that is on Rare right now is really able to create a game like that anymore. I'm just worried because of how bad Sea of Thieves was, honestly. Like, if they make another <laughs> Sea of Thieves, Microsoft's done. They're not going to make another Sea of Thieves for a while. No, I mean, I'm... like, an- another game that's as bad as Sea of Thieves. Ah. Uh, I don't know. Oh, I am doing awful on the stage. Are you still on stage 6? Yes. I'm almost done with it. Oh my god, stop! Stop! <laughs> oh my gosh. This stage is. Have you gotten to the cinematic part with the Star Wars? I'm almost there. I'm already there. Alright, I'm there. Cool, cool. Like you said, this one's gonna be really close. I think the boss fights are really gonna determine it. Yeah. And honestly, with these quick time events, I don't even care if I'm just getting goods. As long as I'm hitting it as fast as possible, that's what matters. I don't even think they matter at, in general. I, I'm still willing well, I mean, to bet that just... I'm going to get an S rank right now. Yes, I yeah, got an S rank. I, and I got goods on them. So they don't oh, matter yeah. at all. Alright, here we go. Let's go. Let's go. Alright, done. So, um, all right, let's move I on think to stage I honestly seven. think Sony's got some surprise um, games at their press conference. I think that they're focusing on those four games that they mentioned, but I definitely think they have some surprises because they have every year. Like last year, we were just expecting them to focus on main games and then they ended up having like God of War and uh, Days Gone or Death Stranding. No, Days Gone, I think it was. It was that zombie game. I forget the name of it, but... I think they have some surprises, but if we're they also for had surpri- <laughs> they also had the Shadow of the Colossus remake last year. Yeah. So yeah, they're if definitely gonna have surprises at some point. If we're looking for the best surprises, though, Nintendo, Nintendo's the one that's gonna deliver. Really, <laughs> no matter what Nintendo shows, they've already confirmed that they're gonna show Smash Brothers. But just depending if it's gonna be a port or a new game. That's already gonna be a surprise in itself. Yeah. Oh, I'm doing the um, the sequence that triggers the together me next to you. <laughs> <laughs> this is one of my We're favorite levels in the game. Fighting <laughs> united with I don't know the lyrics. It's just catchy. If I was, li- I have my game audio muted right now on my TV, so I can't hear anything. <laughs> Uh, but I have I have I, a bunch of different mics plugged in so I can hear you and the game audio <laughs> and also talk. If I was listening to it though, I'd probably try singing along, so it's probably a good thing that I don't have it on. <laughs> oh no! I boosted too much. <laughs> Did he die? Yeah. All right. I hate this part. I'm going on. 
I'm going on the super slow route for this level. I'm on the part where you have to fight all those goons and they like surround you in a circle and you have to jump on the gears and stuff. Yeah. Because I know later on in the game you're able to get a wisp that will let you skip everything. But doing it this way is just so annoying. We're not even annoying, it's just... Uh, no! Shoot. Speaking of E3, I'm also looking forward to Bethesda's press conference, considering they're saying it's the biggest one they're having yet, and then also the Starfield rumors. Oh, that'd be cool. And then, of course, Fallout on Switch. That'd be amazing. Um, I'm not sure if they're going to do another Switch game or not. Because they do have, um, what's it, the Wolfenstein, Wolfenstein game coming? Yeah. But, and I don't know what Skyrim sales were like, but the Doom sales on Switch were awful. Oh yeah, I know. So I don't know if they're going to want to do another port so soon. Honestly, I think they're going to do it just because they can easily cash in on an older game. Yeah. I don't think they'll, if they announce something like Starfield or Doom 2, I don't think they're, they'll instantly port it to Switch. But they might bring back an old game and port it to Switch. Actually, I don't know about that. They might... I get feeling like whatever their next game is going to be, they're going to try getting it on Switch day one. I don't know just because of Doom sales, honestly. Yeah, the only reason, the only thing is the Doom sales, but once again, I have no idea what the Skyrim sales are, and I, I think Skyrim sold pretty well on Switch. I think we can uh, both agree, and everyone watching this too can agree, the best uh, game of 2018 will be WWE 2K19 on Switch. <laughs> I doubt there, I doubt that's even gonna happen. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. If it does happen, I'm buying it day one just to laugh at all the bugs. You know what's gonna have bugs if they do it. You need to let's play the game. I, Did they ever I fix the game? 2K18. No. And honestly, I don't even think it. I, correct me if I'm wrong, but I don't think the Switch version had my career. <laughs> I don't think it did. If it did, uh. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments, guys, but uh, I don't think it did. So it would be impossible to let's play. <laughs> well, just to do one match would be 20 minutes, so that's enough for one episode. Well, I mean, I would have to just... It wouldn't really be a let's play because there's no story involved. I would just have to do, like, uh, single-player matches and then just upload them. The one thing I like about the WWE games is it pretty much has an infinite roster. Like, you can download anyone <laughs> from the community creations. I'm focusing really hard right now. Oh, that was close. What stage are you on? Are you on the Tokyo looking one? Uh, I'm not sure. Are you still on the what, team up one? That? No, I'm not on a on the team up one. I'm oh, still... are you on the one before the infinite boss fight? I might be. I'm on the giant snake right now, so I might be. Oh, the you're way fight. ahead of me. I need oh, to I am? go. Yeah. Frick. Go, 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 go. I thought you were ahead of me. Nah, I'm towards the middle of the stage. Oh, I almost died right there. Right, I got a lot of red I'm coins. On this giant snake, but I just wasn't boosting a lot. I was focused on E3. I forgot to boost. <laughs> that feeling when you forget to boost while you're talking about E3. Got to blame the event, not your, not yeah. yourself. I'm also super excited for BigCon though. That's gonna be lit. Does that? Oh, wait, no, that happens after E3. If I'm yeah, that happens like 10 days after E3. I oh, okay. really wanted to go to E3 next year, but sadly they still have the 17 plus thing and I'll only be 16, so I'll have to wait another year. I want to go to E3 so bad. But yeah, as soon as I turn 17, I'm definitely going to E3. Oh, I died immediately on the infinite boss fight. <laughs> I'm, I'm not even on the infinite boss fight yet. Well, you're probably going to catch up here. Alright, here we go. I made Versus infinite. I made a mistake. I just forgot what the jump button was, so I ran right into his thing that makes you hallucinate. 
Alright, here we go. Infinite. What's up? What's up, Infinite? I already got two hits on him. Tell me why Infinite is so emo. It's because he got his ass beat by Shadow. <laughs> it's like they were trying to do a Shadow the Hedgehog too. They wanted Infinite to be so edgy. If they made oh a Shadow the Hedgehog 2, that probably would have been better than this game, to be honest. Yeah, that would have been awesome. Who knows, E3? Maybe it's a last resort by Sonic Team. <laughs> I think you and I are probably like the only two people who would be perfectly fine with the <laughs> yeah. Shadow the Hedgehog 2. Everyone else would say it's an SJW movement like um, <laughs> Battlefield 5, and I just died. Oh, you did? Mm hmm. Shoot. I'm almost done with the infinite boss fight. I was trying to go too fast. I was trying to uh, get two hits on him and I got greedy. Wait, what? Right. That wasn't the end of the fight? What? No, I missed the boost. Okay, I'm dead for sure. Okay, I hit Oh infinite, my god. But he I'm, didn't I'm die. About to okay, die there again. he goes. Oh my All god. Right. That was right. so close. I almost died. On, I thought for sure I was dead. You're on the infinite boss fight, right? Yep. I just beat him. I'm going to call a bluff on that one just to make myself feel better. <laughs> I got an S rank and I beat it. You can call bluff on it if you want to. What's up, infinite? That was a super easy boss fight. That was a lot easier than Got I him. expected it to be. Got him again. All right, I'm. Good By the way, now. whenever whenever you could pause, just let me know because we should probably stop the episode soon and then right. start the next one. Oh my god, are you freaking kidding me? Okay, I'm good. I almost. Are right, ready to pause? Uh, not yet. Let me beat this. Okay, I'm going on the Green Hill Zone right now, so. I'm able to pause whenever you're able to. I just want to beat this first. Oh no! I did not see that coming! No!